Hey everyone, what's up? Just wanted to do another eruption update. And this one's actually a little bit scarier, I guess, than, than the typical updates I've been doing. As of last night, April 26th, apparently there's a phase change in the activity in vent number five. They're saying that the southernmost vent that opened and has been active since around the 13th of April, the intensity and the explosive activity has increased quite a bit. And now it is shooting this lava out at a height of around 40 or 50 meters high. Now the same too, the activity in vent number six, also from April 13th has appeared to have settled down. So they're wondering, you know, maybe some of these explosive areas, these, these fissures, a lot of them are slowing down and sort of consolidating into one. It, it's unknown right now just because this is so new, but they are going to go and explore what's going on and what this change actually means. Now, because it's going so high in the air, my guess is it's becoming more dangerous than it has been previously. So it is something to keep in mind if you're going to go visit 40 to 50 meters into the air is is really high up and especially if it's larger chunks and it's getting more explosive then you just want to be careful and hopefully everything kind of settles back down but uh, I thought that was definitely something very interesting to take note of the other thing that came to my attention through the through the news is the MBL webcam is probably going to be cut off from the world pretty soon. You can see here on this map, this purple area where the lava has formed as of the 25th. And right in the center of all of this is that camera. The roof cameras, those are still safe on the outside, as you can see to the sort of top of the lava area and to the left. But that MBL camera is definitely in some trouble. And we know, unfortunately, you know, for them, they've already lost one camera to this lava. So I think this is going to be number two. <laughs> they keep trying, they keep placing them in good spots, but then they get destroyed by this lava. You can also see here again, and I've pointed it in other videos as well, but the path A and path B and the amount of lava that's sort of Depicting where these are going, I think based on how the direction's moving, path A should be okay for a little bit of time. And, you know, if we're lucky, it could get shorter as time goes on. It looks that way. And then, of course, path B looks like the safer bet at this time just because it's, it's so much higher up and to the left of where the lava is apparently moving towards. So, just want to do that quick update again. Fireballs basically going straight into the air, 40 to 50 meters up, which is huge. And then the MBL camera might only have a, a few hours or days left before it has to fend for itself against this eruption. So until next time, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the update. If you did, hit the like button and you can hit subscribe. I do all different types of content all the time. So why not check it out? Thanks so much for watching.